What is going on guys, Nifty Bacon with the new Red Dead Redemption 2 video. And I'm going to show you guys how to get the best horse that you can get for free. Now what you have to do is travel out here into the mountains. You want to make sure you have your wintry uh, clothing on so that way you don't freeze and die or anything too early. Uh, but it'll be way up here in the mountains. It'll be pretty easy to get uh, once you get into free mode. It's right here by Lake Isabella. Right up here where this is. And the uh, legendary bison is also up here as well. But you want to be kind of in this general area where I'm at, as you saw on the map. And this is where this horse will show up. And if you aren't too careful, you'll scare it off, as I just did there. So you want to make sure you hold it, uh, down the button uh, for the Xbox One, it's uh, LT, and for the PS4, I think it's uh, L2 or something. I don't use the PS4, so uh, I think that's the right button, but left trigger pretty much on the bottom. And uh, then you can track it as well if you need to. Uh, you just... Uh, push down on both uh, joysticks uh, to get it to go into the eagle eye mode so then you can uh, see its path and you can hit RB to track it and see as I'm holding here the LT button as you slowly approach now you see as he's getting a little bit agitated so you want to calm him so you want to stop walking and so you just slowly walk as you see it, and if you have the vibration on your controller, you'll be able to uh, basically feel the horse's heartbeat. And so the faster it gets, and as it starts speeding up, you can tell it's going to get agitated. So you'll definitely need to calm pretty soon at that point, so you have to be ready as I did there. And just stop, kind of let it calm down slowly approach this is the best way to get this horse so that way it doesn't run off because it, once it spawns in this area and you lose it it's going to be hard to find it again so definitely have to make sure you save before you try doing this and we're almost there just gotta have patience with it just work nice and slow toward the horse now I'm sh not sure if I can actually pat it or anything, or I think it's better just to get on the horse from this point. So you just want to get this close to it as it's calm, jump on the horse, and the tip is you want to push down on the joystick on the left, uh, like downward, and then you want to move in the opposite direction of the horse. So if it goes to the right like it is here, you push left. If it goes to the left, you want to go to the right. And just keep going it doesn't take too long to get it and there you have it and now it is your horse so that is how you get the best horse for free in red dead redemption 2 uh, way out here in the hills and you can call over your other horse and you can saddle up this horse and then just forget about this horse that you have uh, if it's not the best horse, if you want to keep your horse with you, you can have it follow you like I'm having it do. Or you can hitch it to it, and it'll follow you that way. And then you can make your way back to the stable, and then it'll be your horse. And you can keep bonding with it and everything like that. So, that's the best horse you can get for free. Uh, if you want any other ones, you'll have to pay for them, especially the Rose Arabian one. Uh, that's the absolute best horse, but you actually have to pay for it. So if you guys liked the video, definitely leave a like, definitely subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next Red Dead Redemption 2 video.